Hey, welcome back to my channel, Best Practice Gaming. My name is Rob. Uh, today, I am rescuing the Dairy Longhorn from this tree creek. From this creek, let's take a look at the quest here. Seems like our airfield crew managed to get our tow truck stuck in a creek nearby. Usually, I just call another one to pull it out. But that's the only one we have right now. Could you give it a try? And I will do that. Uh, for this rescue here, I got the Caterpillar 745C. I never drove this truck very much when initially playing the game. So I'm not used to it. So it might be a little difficult for me. But let's go ahead and get started. And I also have the fuel add-on for it. Let's take a look at the inside here. Now, this is obviously a specialized truck. I've, I've never seen it out in real life, but I do know it exists. So, But I don't know if like the inside is very accurate. I'd have to look that up online here, but it's not bad. I mean, it's, it's, it's just probably as detailed as it's going to get. So far, the uh, 745C here is actually not doing too bad. That's the one thing about these trucks that are kind of built like this. They don't have a, like a big turning radius. Let me go ahead and move the Jeep here out of the way. Hopefully, I can clear that tree.
Now it looks like it got stuck here. I got the truck around the tree there. It looked like it was stuck there for a minute, but should be able to get it back to the garage now.
Alright. That was rescuing that truck there. Let's have a look at it. Oh, I, it was in uh, it was in neutral there for a minute. And that's why it was in neutral. It's definitely messed up. It's got enough gas in it. Let's just drive it around for a minute and have a look at it. Oh, that's nice. The inside has fans. I think that's really cool. And the fans are actually running. Yeah, the inside doesn't look bad. It's definitely, definitely a, like a serious tow truck setup. Look at those, look at those levers and gears over there. Yeah, I may not be able to drive it around too much, but I can just get a good feel for it here. I do like these like low level and mid tier trucks, but the maps get so much harder. I don't know if a truck like this would be able to cut it further on, especially in a Madra. So it looks like all wheel drive and diff lock are just on. They got the Dairy Longhorn fixed here. I believe that's what it is. Yeah, Dairy Longhorn. Let's drive it back up to the garage. It's, it's fine now. It shouldn't shift out of gear at all. All right, let's see what's available for this truck here. Oh, not bad. Look at that spare wheel setup. Wow. Are they are they zip tied? It looks like they're zip tied to hooks. That's interesting. It also looks like there's another winch along with that. That's really interesting. I wonder if that's a workable winch.
All right. That's it for this playthrough here of Rescuing the Dairy Longhorn 3194. If you guys like what you're seeing, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, share, and hit the bell notification icon for best practice gaming. And again, my name is Rob. In the description below, I do have a few GoFundMe links to help the channel. Have a great day to everybody. Mm -hmm.